Buccaneers, today we're going to unbox the Coding Starter Kit by Osmo. This new product lets you learn the basics of coding with three hands-on coding games. And now let's open it. Oh yeah, that's just sweet. Here we go. Alright. Oh, there we go. Oh, finally. Ooh, stickers. Yeah. And over here says, Welcome, Osmo Knox. Set up. So this sheet tells us how to set up. We're gonna need an iPad. Oh, right. here's an iPad stand. I think I like it. Yep, this stand is for an iPad. And this side. I think it's all the coding stuff. Yep, these are all the coding blocks. Okay, so these are what some of them look like. Well, that's, they're both the same. Oh yeah, there's an arrow in this one, a person. Oh, and there are numbers. Over okay, here. these blocks have numbers. What is that one? There's stars here. All right, so we'll get to see the rest of the coding blocks later, I guess. So that's what you get with the coding starter kit. And now we're going to be doing the three hands-on coding games. First, I'm going to get the iPad and the Osmo stand. And I'm going to take out this. All right, put the iPad on the stand. This is the Osmo reflector. I'm going to put it on top. All right, we'll go onto the iPad, the Osmo folder here, the Osmo folder. All right, I went to the Osmo World app. Now that I'm on the Osmo World app, I can find the game that I want to do. This is Coding Obby from Coding Family. That's got to be the right one. So I'm gonna press go. Hooray, you got a weekly star. Oh, play. Oh, yeah. And there's a play button towards the top. I'm gonna press that. Coding on. Okay, press play. Ooh, there's a map to make a face on it. That's gotta be Obby. No, that's odd. Oh, okay. Check. Uh. Uh. It's probably gonna explode. Oh, a chip. It's a, a chip. Now, nah. it looks like the mountain is sick. Yeah, I think get the wood from the house. Now get the wood to the house, maybe? Oh, to the wood. Oh, so this is probably the first game. So I'm going to put the iPad here, so you guys can see what we have set up over here. Oh, we grabbed the blue thing. Oh yeah, grab the blue running thing. And turn, turn. the dial. Oh, turn. Turn it to this way, I guess. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Oh, good. Now. Oh, touch the iPad. Another. Oh, okay. Three, two, one. one. And then he goes one space. So basically, what this reflector does is it reads the tiles that we place down here, and that's pretty cool. And now it says for us to turn it so the arrow faces down. So now we have it facing down. Oh, there. Two, one, and move down. Okay. Now we're having the arrow go right again. Three, two, two one. one. Okay. Turn. Keep going? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna keep. Oh. oh, three. Oh, okay. So since there's a long stretch of straight, we're gonna get the three. Okay. So we have a number three. Mm -hmm. We're gonna attach it. So now it will go forward three. Oh, it's going three. That was fast. I think now we can go up three. Yeah. Oh. Oh, so now there's a river. Oh. Uh -oh. What do we do oh, now? so we should just go to the river and then turn to the left. Yeah. Right? Let's just do one space. Yeah. Just one. Space. Oh no. 
No. Oh, go three. Oh yeah, the pedal. Oh yeah, the lily pads, of course. The obby can step on the lily pads. That makes sense. So we turn this to the right. We attach a three block. Like this. Okay. Oh, now down, to uh, down, down three, right? Oh, One, and the four. four. Okay, so we're gonna ah, we're gonna switch out the three block for a four. Bit. Right here, four. All right, flip that so it now comes down. Right. Oh, what? Oh, but there's a bear this time. What is the bear? Maybe you could pass. Um, let's try it. Oh, so, let's go five. Actually, I think we should do four first, and then we can see. He lost bad. So it has to Oh, be I guess you're not able to stop on the lily pads. Good, we made it. Oh, so, so I guess we met a bear, maybe? Oh, bear. Oh, down. Oh, to the chest, maybe. Hooray! I think we got the wood. Uh oh, what happened? Oh, press on the campfire thing. What's that? Uh, oh, what I guess we need to maybe spend three wood. Press build. Build. So we built a, a camp fire. Okay, and we did the same thing as before. So I guess in this case, oh. Ooh, we stuck at the yeah. lines. Oh, that might mean finish. Because those lines may finish. I don't oh, know. Good. Oh, maybe we're feeding him a strawberry? Maybe. maybe. Bobby likes strawberries. So there are a total of seven, seven levels. Is that correct? So let's click on level one. So we collected one strawberry. Oh, now it's just to move that way. Oh, oh. So, so now we can add two. Yep. So you're able to add multiple. Oh, because right. yeah, there's clips. Okay. Yes. So first this will go up, and then this will go down. Uh, one, two. One. Two. No, it can only go down one. Oh. Huh. Okay. So I just. And then press on it again. One, two, and press on it again. And press on it again. Okay, and then we can go. Oh, and then we have to go this. Way. Well, I'll just keep clicking on it. You can't because then it's the river. So now we need this one. So that is all for coding Obby. It was pretty fun. I like the look of Obby. He's kind of cute. All right. He looks like a Yeti. Let's try the next game. Yep, coding jam. All right, ready, go. Oh, it's a concert. All right, I'm gonna press play. Whoa, it's so loud. <laughs> Choose your stage name. Charming yeah, Wild yeah, Armadillo. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> press practice. Oh, practice, yes. Zero out of 20. Ooh, okay. Press the one. So there's many different levels again. Yep. Level one. I'll Level one uses the hand. It's the orange one, I think. Yep. Okay. The hand's to the right, like this. Oh. Press. Oh, down. Down, down. and then it picks up the thing. I think that's what the orange means. It picks it up. Okay. What's that one? Oh, now we need to do it left. And then finally, I'm assuming up. Yes. Up. Good. Good. Okay, so that was level one. So I guess they're just telling us how to use the hand. And the next level will be using the move. Okay, I'm pressing the right. And left. 
Good. Hey, I want to do it. Good. That's all. So after five levels, we have unlocked the studio. Let's see what the studio is all about. Good. Okay, I like that. So we have the first guy. All right, next. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, and the last musician guy for the studio. Not this. Okay, that's good. And then... So now, as you can see at our studio, we just created our own music. This is really fun. Uh, yeah, so there's many things you can do with these music blocks. Okay, and now we're going to go to our final game. Okay, start. we're starting coding duo. Oh, press the purple one. Okay, so maybe this is again many different levels. Bravo, I'm glad to have two heroes like you here to help me. But if you're gonna save my poor lost pets, you'll need to work together. We are. Oh, they oh, they're lost pets. What? Those, Those are animals lost. were lost pets. The arrows. Oh, so now we have two yeah. different arrows. So maybe they both go up. No, and we need four to numbers. Oh yeah, four. Four here. Two, three. And that's probably what they mean by coding duo for this game. Because you can code two at once. That is all for the new Osmo Coding Starter Kit. I think it was really cool, and I like how the three games are three different levels of difficulty. Another cool thing is this iPad stand and the reflector, and how it's able to read things on the table. This reflector kind of surprised me because of the long range it can see the blocks. Like, I think it went all the way to here or something. Yeah, really far, really far. So, brother, what was your favorite game? I like Cody Jam. Because I like how you can create your own music with all the different blocks. Okay, and my favorite was Coding Duo because it was the most challenging and also, and also you were able to program the two monster thingies at once. If this looks fun to you, you can order it at the link in the description. Bye! <laughs>